Now I finally found a rat rod I like. BR549. Hmm. I love some of the detail work. Cowbell. Can't have enough cowbell. Camshaft. I love it. It even has seat belt. Can't go wrong. It's own bathroom, tub and uh, toilets. Spittoon, huh? huh? Just gotta call BR549. Next time I got a barn raisin, I know I'm gonna call. We're at the villages. Down here in Florida, just enjoying the car show. Pretty neat place. They do these a lot. This is a nice rat ride. The, the village's beer koozies. Keeps your beer cold. Two plastic cups. Put a uh, napkin in between them. That's another thing I learned today, huh? Never know. Cool, man. I like this one. 1990 Jeep. This is coming from private investigators that are on TV showing the videos and all Cool rat ride. Now here's a truck, work truck. You think it's an automatic, but no, it's got three pedals the way it's supposed to be. Nice six cylinder, that's cool. I can dig it. F100, nice. Kind of a classic rat ride. Classic, pretty classy. You can tell it's fiberglass bucket. Obviously, see the fiber strand. No room for your feet. Love the simple steering linkages on these. Turn one tire and it turns the other tire, right? Love the hand holes. I don't know why there's one on this side. Pretty cool. Let's make one. Seventy three Ford Bronco. Hmm. Hunter. Pretty cool. I sold, because of my neck, I sold my gold wing in 09. I bought a brand new one in 04. A Willis, Jeepster. That's got room. Pretty neat. 
Not sure about the color of that top. 1950s Jeepster. Sixty five Shelby Cobra. See how far that engine's pushed back? The front tires there, the engine's behind it. See that? Puts the transmission way back, and the transmission is to the right of your arm. That's why they handle so good.